Hello Hacienda La Puente, this is Ricardo, one of your tech tosas, and today I want to show you another extension that is going to make your life a lot easier when you grade in SpeedGrader um, in Canvas. So um, last time I showed you a video that actually um, using the uh, Tamper Monkey extension, this one right here, allows your SpeedGrader to now have a box where you can change the status of an assignment to late to missing or to excuse and also to input the dates that it was uh, late and you can update status so this is uh, basically um, those pink or, or um, I think yellow uh, colors that you see on your gray book so um, in the past you had to actually go one at a time and remove it but now you can do it from here okay so that's a video that we've made before and you have that available in our YouTube channel but the one that I want to show you today it's called Canvas um, Betterizer. And then what it does is a couple of things, okay? The first thing that it does is notice that if I type a grade in here, okay, this student got a five, and I press enter, it automatically takes me to my next student. I don't have to be hitting next, next, next. So that's kind of a great tool to have. The other additional uh, feature that it does is that notice that in the bottom now, I have a place where it says insert comments, okay? So instead of me having to come in here and type comments, I've had the ability to go into my extension and I've added some of the most useful comments that I use when giving feedback. So now I don't have to type them or copy and paste again, okay? So I'm in here now, I'm going to add a comment, I'm just gonna go to insert and I'm gonna pick one of the comments that I already decided to use, okay? Submit, it's there, I give a grade, enter, I'm on the next student. So it makes my grading a lot faster. So how do we um, get this extension to work with your canvas? First thing, go to the Chrome Web Store. Okay, once you are there, look for Canvas Betterizer. I think that's how you, you, you say it. Uh, it's this one right here. Uh, for me, you're gonna see that it says remove from Chrome, from Chrome, you are going to add it to Chrome. So go ahead and click to add it. Once you add it, a couple of things, make sure that when you add an extension, you obviously are signed into your Chrome browser. Okay, make sure you are signed in. And when you add it, it might, it's gonna show up over here that it, sh that it was installed, but it might disappear, okay? All you need to do is go to the puzzle, click on it and make sure that you pin it. So you might not see it. So just come to the puzzle and go ahead and pin it and it will appear, okay? After it appears, you can click on it, and you actually can go to SpeedGrader and add your comments. Make sure that when you add it, you save so that they stay there. You can clear them too, okay? Um, I will leave everything else that is over here turned on, and then once you're done, you can save it. Um, there's other stuff in here, uh, remove gradebook uh, tooltips, and then shrink messages in a box. You can leave that on too by default, okay? But once you've done that, go ahead and refresh, and again, there's going to be a couple of things that are going to happen. Insert comment is going to show up, and now you have the access to the most useful comments you need. And when you um, put a score and you hit enter, it's going to take you to the next student. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to reach us. Have a great day.